maddest game I've ever been to in my life. Kisa Talin scores! I haven't missed the messages. I've seen the hype. Football in Scandinavia, it is crazy, and I've never once visited. See, back in 2019, I witnessed Chelsea play Malmo on a Champions League night. Yes, the Blues won, but I was left thinking the passion from that away block was just incredible. Oh my God, what is going on here? So, why is this all relevant? Well, fast forward to today, we enter the final week of the Alsven scam. Yes, you heard me right. Harsh winters means their season starts in March and ends, well, tomorrow. So, league table, Malmo sit in second and are three points behind first, where Elfsborg lie. Goal differences, exactly the same, 34. And the league calendar has somehow blessed us. The final game week, they're playing each other. Meaning winner takes all. Draw and Elfsborg have it. This is a league decider and we may never see something like this ever again. So get ready for history because it's time for me to finally witness Swedish football. touchdown in Malmo. It's the morning. It's the calm before the storm. Now today's massive, right? And it's not just massive for us and the Malmo fans, it's for Idol Johnson because he'll definitely be in the match. He's got a son who's 25 years old called Svein Johnson who plays for Elfsborg. He's their regular winger. Then he's got an even younger son called Daniel Johnson. You may know him because he played for Barcelona Real Madrid in the academy days. Now he's at FC Malmo's academy. So he's played one game. So if the Johnson family wins no matter what tonight, hopefully we can remake this photo today. Let's check out the city and let's go to the stadium. We've got Casper. You excited for the match today? How are you yeah, feeling? I'm feeling good. We're playing a good team that counterattacks a lot. So yeah. we'll see how long we do. We got some falafel. Yeah. With my mate Isaac. Come from England for the game. Cool. Cheers. Cheers, mate. You ready for this? Let's have it. Let's have it. Let's go. This is proper. Pre match snack. Awesome, out of 10. We were 9. 10 out of 10. Cheers. And what should I expect for the Malmo fans today? What's the atmosphere like? That a lot of singing and uh, <laughs> no one is allowed to sit today. Everyone is going to stand. Well, we found the Malmo fans. Mental. It's like the morning. Everyone's in the pub. We're doing a review here. Falcon Expert. Never tried this before. Here we go. Amazing. Solid. 8 out of 10. It's midday in Malmo. Everyone's going mad. Cheers. Look, even the chef's out. The chef's out. Score prediction? 3-0 Mamo. I think a 2-0 no win for Mamo. 5. Oh, no question no, no, today. I'm serious, I'm serious. 5-1. 2-0. 3-0. 3-0. And yeah, the goal is coming home to Mamo again. <laughs> what are you going to do after the match if Malmo the match, win the league? We're heading back here and we're going to have to go <laughs> wow, the ultras have made it. This is mental. <laughs> what are you feeling so far? Well, I want Mamo to win. <laughs> You've converted one England fan already. 3-2, yeah. last minute winner. Last minute winner, let's see. Go! Let's go, come on. Go! Cheers. 2-0. 2-0? Yes. Uh, two zero. Wow. <laughs> This guy's loving it. I watched football in a lot of European countries, but I finally ticked off Sweden. And these fans are serious. They're passionate and coming early. So, this is the Galma Malmo Stadion, the old ground. It's iconic, but they no longer go there. Hey, yeah, hey, yeah, Malmo. <laughs> We've met the fans. It's nearly over an hour till kickoff. I think there's only one thing to do before we head inside. We've got the blue and white. We are ready. Let's go. Come on. Isaac's kitted out. Have you found your new team? New second club, first Let's Newcastle. Go, Let's go. Stadium looks cool with the old man behind us and the newer one right in front of us. Elada, we're going to see absolute carnage. This is the best thing. In England, it's banned. In Sweden, beers at your seat. Cheers, mate. There's one for you. And behind us, the Ultras, 45 minutes till kick off. Life is good. Cheers. Here come Malmo in their white training tops. Claps all round. Match day 30. First versus second. The league calendar has blessed us. And now, they have to get the job done. Blue Pyro already set off. Flags, scarves, everything. I was speaking to a few Malmo fans, they haven't been in a top four team all season. When they went to Elfsborg away this year, they lost 3-0. But now, it's in their hands. Win at home, you win the league. Elfsborg, booze from the home end, for the away end, collapse and sinks. 20 minutes till kickoff. Look at this, the whole ground. The whole ground. This is amazing. All led by the ultras behind the goal. Isaac is loving it. He's getting ready. 
most prestigious, the most successful club in Sweden. We saw the story with Dortmund. They just had to beat Mainz at home, and they couldn't get the job done last year. Now, can Malmo do it? The synchronisation is incredible here. The effort that must have gone in to get this round the ground before the match. I love it. Ilva Sebastian Namasi. Six of the eleven. Started that. So what's that gonna do for them? Be together. Wow. Those three Elfsborg fans just standing on top of the advertising board, beers in hand, loving it. The display rises behind the goal. Just before the players walk out here, Patrick on a hat with three different players. Some serious effort must have gone into that. Elfsborg fans in yellow and black with a banner as well. Unbelievable show here from Malmo. Unbelievable. The away fans have set off. Final moments before kickoff here. How big of a deal this is. It all comes down to this. Interesting tactic here. They're switching sides after the coin toss. Elfsborg will play in front of the Malmo Superfan. We are underway here in Sweden. The decider. Here we go. The pyro show begins. All in black. The key player here for Malmo, Pontus Janssen, ex Brentford, ex Leeds. He's been in the Premier League. Can he deal with this? Good save. One of the players of Elfsborg has got a shot off. We're literally one minute in. And it's already firing. I couldn't tell you what's going on. Everybody's jumping and singing. Red Pyro all over. Sets Malmo up here, great chance. Really good early chance here for Malmo. 14 minutes in. Surely, what a chance. Elfsborg, no, if the game stays 0-0. They win the league. Ali's through. And when Ali's through, oh, Malmo's right wing are really excited. He might have come from Somalia and he absolutely cooks all the defenders with it. That's what he needs to do with the ball. He needs to make something happen, that one moment, to win them, not just the game, but the league. The stewards have come onto the field here. I think one of the fans, I think it's for a fan. The club staff went on to check on a fan. It's difficult to know what's going on in the situation down in the corner of the ground. And the whole match, the whole match is stopped. And we're back on the way. Is this it? Is this the moment? Deflection. They're given 10 additional minutes before the half-time whistle. We're currently in the 53rd, so there's two minutes left. Four the balls to come. Great chance for Malmo. They need a goal from somewhere. Oh! Mm. Half time here, Pontus Janssen runs straight over to get the ball. It's an eerie feel here in the stadium because everybody knows without that goal, the away team get, get the lead. You think Elfsborg have got this? Um, yeah, definitely. Really? They're defending very well. The only thing is they don't look like they have much on the attack. I thought I'd travelled the furthest for this match. I'm wrong. These guys have come all the way from the USA. We've got Blake and Andreas. Guys, I mean, first of all, so you're, you're from Malmo, right? Yeah, we're from here, yeah, born and raised. What do you reckon? Full time score, what's going to happen? Uh, I think it's going to be 1-0 Malmo. Well, this is pretty cool. What, what's, your, what's your middle name? Zlatan. Zlatan. Yeah. After the man himself. What is going on here? All kicking off in the away end. Really getting tasty. Good. I think what they've done is broken the neck down so they can pitch invade or get nearer to the pitch if they do eventually win at full time. Because remember, at oh, Pyra's out. They're kicking to them. It's all kicking off now. The police are pushing the net back. This is a bad idea. This is a really bad idea. The police are battling them. Oh! They've got Pyro in their face. Oh! It is all kicking off. The Swedish police, they've given up. The fans have won. The fans have actually won this. The Almo fans are seeing throw out the pack. It's like the police just throw out the whole away end after what we've seen. I can't believe what I'm seeing here. The Elfsborg player has come to tell him to bring the net back. And they have brought the net back. Oh, wow. And now it's just kicking off. Pyro. That whole situation's made it worse. A guy in a mask just giving it large. You, you do not see this in your average English football match, I tell you that. 
I don't, they don't, we don't even have nets in the away end. Massive fight for the net. We want our net back. We want our net back. We want our net back. I got It's the same old story on the other side of the away end. The fight for the net begins. Police holding it back. Elfsborg fans want it. So we've waited over 15 minutes and with the net being obstructed, the players won't re enter the field because it's a safety hazard. They can throw pyros directly at the players. Yeah, it's crazy. The police are slight, it's starting to get the net back. They are punching and they are fighting. Match can be cancelled. Oh no. I've never been to a, an abandoned football match. They burn it right there. They down the front, yeah. The first bunch of players are back out after what's been about 40 minutes. Delight inside the ground. The boys in white and blue are back out. The players are going to have to delay the beginning of the second half at 10 because of this. The visibility might be a little bit hard. Smoke alarm has gone off. I can't believe this back. Viktigt meddelande. What is this? Viktigt meddelande. Rand har utbrutit i byggnaden. Are we going to have to leave the stadium? Lämna omedelbart byggnaden genom Is the game over? Använd inte I, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Done Attention, thing. please. Fire has been reported in the building. Please no surprises leave there. The no surprises. What? The no. Nearest exit. What? Do not use the no. elevators. They, they're saying match abandoned. Fire. They're abandoning the match. You can't even see the stand anymore. Viktigt meddelande. Viktigt meddelande. Attention, please. Oh shit. Fire has been reported oh fuck, someone's gonna fall here. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. It's absolutely kicked off there. Aftermath of the fight there. Fire has been reported in the building. I just don't know I just don't know why this Please is happening. No idea. Not a single ultra has left their spot. It's claps. What does that mean? It's starting again! I was so sure it was Flaskor said that the game was off, but it's restarting. Come on. No, we're going to see a result. Malmo fans are ready, and the away block haven't left either. And we are finally back on the way. All eyes on Malmo. And now, oh! Imagine, imagine we see a moment now. Oh, oh, no! Oh, so close. Some good football. We played it. Oh, that! No! Yes, we are only in the 50th minute. Two chances in two minutes. Should have been two goals. But this is more what Malmo needs. Getting tasty on the field as well. Malmo, up the left flank. Oh, is that a pen? It's a pen! Yeah! Oh my days! Huge moment here in Sweden. Malmo with a penalty. <laughs> and if this goes in and they score it, they go up to first place. Talk about nerves for the penalty taker. The referee speaking to Isaac Kisa to lead the striker. Behind the goal, away fans trying their best to distract the Malmo forward. Kisa to lead. Scores! Malmo! Malmo! I'm done it! Unbelievable! After the match almost being abandoned. Come on! All behind the goal. I was ready to break my flight home, and now they're top of the table. Let's just hope that this behind me doesn't abandon the match again. Unbelievable. Fine, Good Johnson on the pitch, and Daniel Good Johnson for Malmo warming up. I told you, you'll be somewhere in the stadium. Yes, that has to be a straight red, a straight red card. And if, if it's a foul, it's definitely a red card. Last map. They show odds in the stadium here, but it does show you how in favour they think Malmo are going to win this game now. They're singing Abba here. Might be a second. Surely. Oh. See, being Sweden's most popular crowd, they've got to have at least one song in the rhythm of Abba. Understood. Three minutes left of normal time. Seen a match at risk of being completely suspended, played another day. We would have missed the story. And if they can hold on, they win the league. Malmo fans are oh, loving it. Elsborg. 
What a block, last ditch defending. They're doing everything they can. Oh, my days. No, 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 no. Fans struggling to watch. 25th minute, look, whatever happens now, we have witnessed through this football to its max. Crazy fans, Cairo, choreography, singing. That doesn't deserve a light, I don't know what it does. This is the full throttle match day. Everyone's heart is racing in the stadium. It's done! Full time! Malmo are champions! It's Sweden! And everyone's on the field! Unbelievable! Malmo are champions of Sweden again! And it is over now! All the way from New York! Oh my god! Christian! Yes, man! Yes! Oh my god, this fireworks! Fireworks being shot at the away end! Oh, it's going to kick off big time now. Fireworks for the home and away end. Elfsborg finished second in the league. Malmo finished top. Fireworks! Oh my god. Maybe the maddest game I've ever been to in my life. One of the Malmo players in tears. The police are stopping the pitch invasion here. The away fans. Over there. As they sing about their 23rd league title. They're going to have to update the cycle. 2022, now 2023. There's the manager. Welcomed out by the fans on the field. And the players. And as Malmo lift the trophy, that wraps up probably one of the craziest football matches I have ever been to. Yes, there was only one goal on the pitch, but we literally waited almost an hour at half time. There were scraps around us in the away end between the police, the pitch invasion, the passion we saw. I loved it. Smash the like, subscribe for more. Swedish football did not disappoint.